Fernando has always been this really amazing, fun, funny, driven, ambitious person and he's never been scared to just go out there and do it. He really immerses himself in what a brand wants or what a client wants and he really gets it. He really goes the extra mile to kind of deliver something that's a little bit different. My name's Fernando Barraza and I am a fashion stylist first and foremost. I have been for the last 17 years. But I started in makeup, I then got into fashion styling. Um, I've been shooting as a photographer for the last seven years and I do a fair bit of creative direction. So I absolutely love it. And uh, yeah, I wear different hats every single day of my working life. You, you look amazing, amazing, amazing. That's better. Cool, I'm happy with that. Um, I feel that for me really it's a lifestyle. I get to travel to some of the most amazing places in the world. I work with absolutely incredible clients most of the time and I get to play and create this fantasy land. For me it's really gratifying to be able to present something to the world that is beautiful, that's gorgeous and that I'm really proud of. For me I, I really do hope that we make a difference, you know, one sequin at a time. <laughs> Ultimately, creating this series really allows the average person to have a backstage pass, I guess, into my world. We're here in Melbourne for Melbourne Spring Fashion Week. I've been doing it for six seasons now and I absolutely love coming to Melbourne to work with some of the best of Australia's uh, designers. Uh, we're about to go into rehearsals in the next 20 minutes or so. It's the cruise show, uh, working with swimwear and resort collections. It's a really cool setup. It's a, like a Australian 1970s kind of vibe. Uh, you know, we've got AstroTurf and we've got like really fun graphic prints. So for me, it's really exciting. I'm working with some of the best and uh, yeah, I think it's gonna look awesome. Thank God I've got an amazing team and Bonnie has been my rock. He is a little tornado. So intense, so insane, but it has been so much fun and he is an amazing mentor. I learned so much from him every time I work with him. But how much more dramatic And is especially that? because it's... Right, <laughs> You are so good at what you do. It's like your stylist. stylist or something. <laughs> I'm really super hypercritical it's about everything. Awesome. You know, every single accessory, every single bangle, how the necklace falls for me is really important. With any live show, you never know what it's going to be like until it happens, but you can never be too prepared. And I honestly believe that we've got the best team possible with the best models um, and the best production behind us, so I'm really excited. So now we're basically going to just finish off hair and makeup, uh, some lighting plots, and then we're pretty much ready for showtime. Today is all about the high summer period, so we've got a wonderful resort show. It's going to be very reminiscent of the late 70s and 80s, Australiana, but we're doing it in a very cool, mashed up way. Oh, half turn, round, beautiful, giving it Naomi. And turn, and off she goes. Fernando is not only a lot of fun to be around, but he's an excellent stylist. He's got a really great eye and he can tone it up and he can tone it down. Your section, I mean, you know you're amazing, so I don't need to tell you this, but it looks incredible. <laughs> but it'd be lovely if we can add an accessory or something. Like either a bracelet or an earring or a clutch or a sunglass or something. Models normally are getting hair and makeup and, you know, catwalk ready for at least three hours before the show. The inspiration, it's a little bit 70s, um, just kind of beach babe, a little bit rock and roll. We've wrapped it up with the bright blue under the eyes. That's really the moment that I have to actually do final checks on all the outfits. It's always great to go and see Kevin and just make sure that the hair looks great. This particular look was a uh, really sort of like teenager hair, to tell you the truth. So we went for a very relaxed, undone, a very uneven wave. Good. Let me just. <laughs> so you're not all oily. That looks much better. Thank you. Show me your bangles. Beautiful. Lovely. Uh, so far, so good. Look, I mean, it's always going to be crazy a couple of minutes before the show. Everyone's ready to go, doing final checks, and then we can get the ball rolling. I'm excited. I think it looks amazing. So <laughs> look at these two. Do you snort? <laughs> Last 
check on Sarah, Mary, Eliza, Kawani, Fiona, and still going to check on the other side. Uh, yeah. Girls, just final checks. Just checking everything. Thank you. I guess with the last minute checks, it's really just to make sure that the look looks perfect. You know, there's nothing worse than a necklace not sitting right or seeing a brass strap or a G-string or any of that stuff. It has to look like it's a photo. So for me, it's the most important moment before each model walks out. So that's, that's my job. Yeah, that necklace just sounds like a choker. Thanks, babe. I think you need to laugh, you need to have fun and you know ultimately we work in fashion, we're not curing anything, like we're, we're working with clothes. I let everyone else dress, you know, <laughs> my job is to make sure that each girl looks amazing. Amazing. I mean, everyone killed it. The music was amazing, the models were amazing. Uh, best team ever, so I'm really, really excited and I really, really, really need a drink. Good work. Killed thank it. You. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, Danskis for another year. <laughs>